again, everyone. Today we're here at our local DIY dog wash, Rosie's Barquet. This is where I go to give Coco her baths. I absolutely love this place, so if you are a Tucson local, go check it out. They have two locations, one in Oro Valley and one right off 4th Avenue. Anyway, today's video is Coco's grooming routine. Here we go! The first thing I always do when arriving is cut and dremel her nails. It's much easier when she's dry, that's why I do it first. You can see she's not a huge fan, but it has to be done. Dremeling is much better for her than cutting. As you can see, she's falling asleep. Isn't that cute? Next, I trim her paw fur so she's safe for escalators. After that, it's time to deshed her. I use a Furminator before and after baths as well as a deshedding shampoo. It's very important for service dogs to be as shed free as possible because of possible dog allergies people may have. Nature's Miracle de-shedding and odor blocking shampoo and conditioner. For her face, I use the hypoallergenic shampoo provided by Rosie's Barquette. and paste and use ear cleaning solution in her ears. Oh, look at that sad little puppy. this okay, but again, you can see she's not the biggest fan.
Rosie's Burkett, I used to do her baths at home in the tub. It used to take about half a day and she'd run around the rest of the day damp. Here, it takes about an hour and a half or so and she's dry when we leave. I really do love this place. For me, it's definitely worth the money. In case you were wondering how much a DIY dog wash costs, here's Rosie's menu. I hope you enjoyed the video. See you next time!